good evening to everyone <clears throat> once again we are back again today i think it's going to be the recap from yesterday all right so we're going to play some music uh, until people can come back and conclude our discussion from yesterday all right uh, we're going to play, play some interesting music until people comes uh then we conclude our yesterday discussion mark jabate discussion all right because this issue it need to be a continuation issue until i you know our problem be resolved you cannot do anything at any time and then just walk out free. I think this is impossible. At this stage of life that we are saying today, no way. Oh yeah, we're waiting for Jamama Wadada. We're waiting for Jamama Wadada to continue our discussion from yesterday. The, discu the discussion needs to be continued today. You know, you can't be, you can't come here to tell us anything you feel like, man. They were so advanced. If you any nonsense on media, we're going to make sure we, you know, we gather the information. And then we want to know where you gather your source from. The statement that you make, the source of that statement, we want to know and see it to know the reality. You can fool us at any time you wish. Oh. You can fool some people sometimes, man, but you can fool all people at all times. The voice of the voiceless. to entertain you before we go ahead to conclude our discussion from yesterday. Once again, Mohamed Manjutre of Newark, New Jersey, in the United States of America. All right. We have, we have like 10 minutes of entertainment and then we conclude from yesterday. Uh, let me give the recap from yesterday. Uh, once again, a man called Mad, uh, 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 Mad Jabate he sorted our imams. I you know very, very emotional and uh, attract them personally. So we are doing this uh, continuation of uh, 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 of the uh, abuse that he made to our imams in order to post stop to that. I know he made a video today. You know uh, he made a video today because uh, I try to connect him yesterday but um he dropped the line but i believe today i'm gonna make sure to connect him because we said if you don't want to be straight we're gonna go to you if you don't want to be straight we're gonna go to you you can give us missed information at any time you wish we say big no to that once again we for our people and we believe that our people for us Mohamed Manjou today, man. Oh, the voice of the voiceless. We know more people want to do the same thing that we're doing, but uh, it's not everybody that can come and talk, you know, uh, our life. 
Some people, if you get a microphone to talk, they get confused right there. Phobia, you catch them. We need to talk. Our right is talk. We need to talk to show our right, right? If you keep short, then you'll be redeemed. Your right will be redeemed. We have uh, eight more minutes for entertainment, and then we do the continuation of our discussion from yesterday. Mad, uh, Mad Jabate is sort of serving to eight imams in our district number two, Labibu. We want an immediate apology from Mark Jabate. Emotional statement that he make, he need to apologize. If he doesn't apologize, then we're going to go to him. You need to apologize, Mark Jabate. You can't fool everybody at the same time with your misinformation, la lies information, they say. You can't take that. That time goes away. This time, no. <laughs> we have seven more minutes for entertainment, then we continue our discussion from yesterday. Uh, later on, I think we're going to allow people to call and give their, you know, um, uh, to give their view about the discussion from yesterday and uh, what we are going to say today. So they're going to look at everything and uh, we are doing the conclusion of Mark Jabate issue today. Regarding if he apologize, but if he does not, and then we're going to keep on to him until he apologize to our emails. You can't insult people just like that and walk away free. No. Mind you, Teresa, it's a big lie. It can't happen. the entertainment and uh, go ahead with uh, yesterday's discussion. We're going to do the conclusion today anyway. Mark Jabate insulted seven to eight imams in district number two. So we need an immediate apology from him to the imams or else we're going to go to him. You can't insult people and walk free. Oh no! All right, our discussion continued from yesterday. Mark Jabate is sorted seven to eight imams in district number two. So today we are doing the uh, the conclusion of the discussion regarding uh, we need an uh, immediate apology from him to the imams. Uh, I, uh, I watched a video from him to, uh, today. So he make a video. So I read the video and then uh, we're going to do the continuation on the video and make sure he apologize because he cannot insult our leader and walk free. We say no. Majority will say no to that. If you make any statement this time, we want to make sure to dig the source of the uh, uh, statement that you make. 
you can't come and gather false information or, or and come, I mean, you can't come sit down on social media and give us any, I mean, false information of your choice and then you want, you, ex, you expect us to take that because we are not in your country. We say no to that. False information, we can't take it. Mislead information. You can't mislead us this time. We are in a modern world. Immediate apology, you need to give that to our imam from your emotional statement that you make to the imams, seven to eight imams, you need to apologize. If you don't, we're going to go to you. Trust me. The only way we're going to leave you alone until you apologize. If you don't apologize, brother, we're going to, we're going to creep behind you. This time, we're not, we're not, we're not, we're not, we're not into a team any stupidness from anybody just like that or any stupid words from anybody just like that you need to apologize and apologize immediately all right and apologize immediately we have uh, three more minutes of entertainment and then uh, we go ahead with our discussion mark jabate is sorted seven to eight months in district number two so we want to do something about this and uh, make sure we put stop to this issue those uh you if you try to be arrogant we're going to make sure to put stop to that our community is not you know uh just like that that anybody can say anything at any time they wish no if you are saying anything you will be judged you will be judged to what you said yeah do we have three, we have three more minutes to entertainment as i said and then we're going to continue to our uh i mean we're going to continue on our discussion from uh, yesterday mark jabate insulted seven to eight imams in district number two once again this uh this show is brought to you by uh, mohammed manjutre of newark new jersey from the united states of america <laughs> Two more minutes of entertainment. Yeah, that's how war go I mean the war is looking like. You know, we are in a modern war. If you make any statement, we want to make sure we know what I mean, what is the reality, where the source of that statement is coming from. We need to know the source of the, the statement that you made. All right. We have one more minute of entertainment, then we go ahead with the discussion. Once again, if you don't, uh, you, you just join us, uh, the discussion here, Mark Jabate, uh, is sorted seven to eight imams in district number two. So we are making sure to post up to those kinds of uh, uh, issues in our district and make sure our fathers are respected, even though uh, 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 they are imams, and you know, that oh, imams need to be patient. Anybody you sort imam, you need to be patient because you need to, uh, you don't say you need to accept everything. Yes, although you need to accept everything, but uh, common men cannot just come on social media insulting anyone just like that. You know, we need to talk. Again, the voice of the voiceless. All right, the entertainment is going to end here. And uh, we're going to go ahead with the discussion from yesterday. Uh, what the discussion is about here, what the discussion is about here today is that uh, Mark Jabate insulted seven to eight imams in district number two. If you are joining us later on, we're going to open the line so you can call and give your own, your, your, your own view about the issue, how we can handle the, the situation, all right? We need an immediate, you know, apology from him. He need to apologize. If not, we're gonna go to him. The only way we're gonna leave him alone until he apologize to the imams, all right? He made a video today uh, regarding to uh, regarding my video yesterday when uh, uh, I came on live and I talked about that issue that uh, the action that he did it was wrong. So after the discussion, I try to connect him to get his own uh, his, I mean to get the view from him and uh, tell him uh, uh, the, 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 the 
they chew or uh, he call he he answered the call and then later on uh he dropped the call he didn't accept to talk to us but however we are making sure that uh, this guy you know apologize to our fathers apologize to our leaders all right we can say anything at any time no we say no to that all right so this guy need to apologize an immediate apology we needed from him all right if you are not on the show yesterday we're going to play the uh the statement that he make to the imams so you can listen to it and then uh, we go ahead with uh, the discussion all right but this guy need an apology to the imams not me but he needs to apologize to the imams of district number 2 the seven to eight imams that he included he needs to apologize to them all right oh uh, ibrahim masarin is asking what's up my man cool if you are listening to me right now uh we are here with the discussion from yesterday uh we are making sure that uh, mark jabate uh apologize to our imams All right, Mark Jabate need to apologize. We need an immediate apology from him. If he cannot, we're going to go to him. All right. You need to apologize. All right, we're going to play the video here. Oh my god. All right. Yeah. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Again, you know. This is a statement that he made to our imams. The emotional statement, the insult, abusing them slightly, and you know, and then he just want to walk free with the insult. No, you need to apologize. No matter who you are, if you're not trying to be right, if you go astray, we're going to make you to be straight. No. Don't be rude. Do anything you want to do is your right, but don't insult people. It's not anything you do is right. You see? This is. Oh my God. Hold on. All right. I think I'm going to add the volume, all right? As a political institution. All right. Using the mosque as a political institution. This is him. Politics again. Oh. We want fairness. God believe in what? Justice. Right? God this is believe him. in justice. How many times we educate that we, we told our imams to stop using the plural mosque in Tesh number two as a political. Uh, hold on. I'm sorry for that. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, I have a like technical error here. Imam to stop using the floor must be. Uh, okay, I'm trying to enlarge it so you can see his face good. All right. Wait. Oh yeah. This is That's Uh, I'm sorry for that. Uh. Oh my god, I'm sorry for that. Oh. I'm sorry for that. Um I'm very sorry for that. Uh I'm very sorry for that. Oh. I have a little bit technical problem here, but uh I'll be back as soon as possible. All right. Because this guy need to apologize. We want to make sure he apologize to our imams. You can't insult people just like that. Yeah. Uh, Ibrahim Masai is sending messages here. Uh, all right. If you just joining us, our today discussion is on Mark Jabate insulting seven to eight imams in district number two. 
So we are making sure that he apologize to uh, the imams that he insulted from Amagasi, Blagina, and uh, our chicken farm community. So this guy need to apologize. He make a video today. So we are going to uh, play the video as well so you can listen to him. But uh, I think I see that video to be like uh, an apology video. But uh, the bad part about the video, he said he did not regret of making uh, the emotional statement on our imam. So because of that war, it brings to my intention that uh, we need to make a video on him too to make sure that he apologize to our imam. All right. We can't gather false information, allegation on people, and then lie on people's name, and then you turn around to be rude, insult them, and, you know, telling them that they are liar, they are giving misleading information to people, and then they are, um, I call it, they are doing something that is not even required in Islamic religion, and they came, they told you that they saw God. God told them second is gonna win and second did not win while God told them it was a lie. Who are you? We want to know. Yes. Like I said, we want to know. Alright, I'm making sure to play the video so you can uh, listen to the video as well. Okay. All right, I'm still checking for the video. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. This is not time to call if you just joining us. Don't call me at this time, please. This is not time to call. We want to give the people the detailed information about the rudeness, about the emotional statement from Mark Jabate. Uh, in district number two. So after the discussion, you can call and uh, and uh, give us your view. But it's not now. Don't call now. If you call now, I'm not going to take no call at this time. All right. Please, if you are just joining us, don't call me at this time. All right. We're going to give you the time to call and be part of the show, please. All right, Master Conan, if you're just joining us, our today discussion is on Mark Jabate insulting seven to eight imam in district number two. Brother Ibrahim Kali, uh, uh, Kali Adam Ture, brother, if you're just joining us today, our discussion is on Mark Jabate insulting seven to eight imams in district number two. So we are making sure that uh, he apologize. We are making sure that this guy gave an apology to the imams. He need to make a video of apology or else we're going to go to him. I'm sorry for any inconvenience. All right, this is the video right here. We are still looking for the video. Yeah, I want to make sure you listen to the video of what he said. Uh, like that, there will be no um they say because that video from him, you know, emotional video, woo video, insulting video abusing all our imams in our community right and then he want to walk out free we say no to that okay so we are making sure this guy apologize all right all right this is the video right here I'm I'm going to make sure to save this video. Okay. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good I think morning. you know this guy. I will continue this message until most of our imams can be educated. 
Right, I think you you, you know this guy, right? Right. If you're just joining us, our today discussion is on Mark Jabate. We need an immediate apology from him to our imams in district number two. He's going to win the election. He said they have a revelation from God about seven or eight imams. I'm going to give you a few minutes so you can listen to him. have revelation that's going to win the election. But now the question is why is going to not win the election? You told us that you make us see Kala. That's who's going to win the election. Why did they not win the election? We continue to tell our people or our imam, let us stop using mosque as a political institution. Using a mosque as a political institution does not make sense. Politics is a game. But when it comes to God, God is God believes in what? Fearless. God believes in what? Justice. God believes in justice. How many times we educate that we, we told our imams to stop using the plural mosque in district number two as a political institution? They did not listen to us. But look at today. They told us that they went and made the Kala. That's who's gonna go to win the election. So we're gonna have lose the election. So the million dollar question, what happened to the revolution? That they got from the whole material. All right. Massa Pone said he's, she saw the video today. Uh, she said she saw the video today and uh, the video was rude. Exactly, baby. Sister, you got it right. This video was rude. So we need to do something about it. If this guy don't apologize, we're going to go to him. I said that. I'm not denying the fact. But the most important thing here is that our imam should not use the boss. Thank you, Masa, for that statement. Thank you very much. You can send your comment. I'm going to read your comment so that the audience that are watching us at this time is going to understand what you mean. Masa said, I seen the video today and uh, that video was rude. All right? I'm not making mockery of them. I'm not making mockery of the Imam. I love the Imam. He's our Imam. We have to respect them. I get a great respect for our imams. But why are the imams they have to go in caucus telling us that that the message is the color, that they saw God. God told them. Who, who was the winning. imam that told you the message so is color, they saw God, God told them. You, so need to you need to tell us. You need to tell us. If you don't tell us, we can God. leave you alone. Well, so I can God. leave you alone. I'm Mohammed <laughs> Majutu, I can leave you. So gonna, you need to yeah, apologize. No. An, an immediate apology need from yeah, you. Oh, also, no. It's neither from you, right? Now. Imam and I will continue you call imams also. <laughs> I'm going to make video on all the imams. They say they're going to win. Okay, make video. I'm here to, to make video on you. And the next time I'm, I'm coming here on live, so just to give your your entire <laughs> your entire <laughs> lifelet profile to people. <laughs> we make it, I will make sure you apologize. Percent. You you need to apologize that now. They lie on the almighty Allah. You say God, you don't talk to God business. The more you try to do corporate things on God business, God is really Those that are not part of the entertainment, so I'm so sorry. We play some beautiful our music our from our old musicians. Our hey, no. Uh, we apologize for our that. If you just join us bent. anyway, we're going to entertain you, gonna to to you to maybe Allah, in a Allah, better part of the show. All right? <laughs> Why you came up with a music? That's who's going to go to win. Every time you make an answer in the mosque, me and you are by will. Sama Kore knew. Mona Sisi Karakela. Mona Sisi Karakela. I'm not getting you now. Listen to him, right? So Sisi Karakela. This guy is rude. Sisi Karakela is the Alima Miu. Il est allé musée de Magashi Missida. Il est allé musée de Blagina Missida. Attacking them personally. Personal attack. Tiki Fan Missida. Lepeta Missida. On est en Missida, you know. Calling their names. Stop lying. Then you say you're not against the imams. You say you're not against no imams. You're not trying to be rude on the imams. Are you are completely rude. 
Allah ya dogu ya. Uma ani mama uzi zani. Adoni ke wote. Juu zala kula. Aki wui. Kwa na sisi kara kila. Kusuru kwenye. Kwa tenge. Ano makeyo. Aka wui ya kuteyi. Tell in our imams. Aka wui ya kuteyi. Relate to the guy. Ati ni wui. The issue there. You don't get in the message in a valley talawole. I'm saying that they came out to say that the Almighty Allah sent revelation to them. God did not tell them that SMC is going to spoil the boat. God did not show them that. They say, what does they say? Photo. What are you doing? Photo. As far as they're concerned, they have received a revelation that the Almighty Allah has told them that two are going to go the way. That is my argument. You don't joke with God's name. You start making fun of God. You don't do business with the Almighty Allah. It's very, very bad. This is why. I hope you see him clear, right? And that's the guy who insulted all of our imams. We want to make sure this guy apologizes. If he does not, uh, we can't leave him. We're going to go to him. All right? And uh, we're going to show you maybe the video he makes today. I see that, um, I know, I see that video to be a video of apology. And, you know, because that was not emotional to admit the fact. That video was not emotional. And, you know, but the thing that makes that video, you know, the, th the, the statement that spoiled that video too, he said he did not regret of making this video. So he needs to apologize. Um, Aliu Soko, if you just joining us, uh, today we are discussing uh, an issue from, I mean, uh, from yesterday. Uh, Mark Jabate insulted seven to eight imams in district number two. Master Kone just saying, you know, messages and she said, we the Madingo are not united, but this is not the way to to address the issue. All right, thank you, thank you very much, baby. Thank you, Sister Master. So you're giving like the street pastors now. And uh, uh they're around, they're thank you. Around here, pastor dance. So if you want to use our mouse as a political institution, are you going to use our mouse as a social area hero? Are you want you want, you want to use our mouse as a political hustle ground? You say how God make God are making people shame, and God will continue to make people sh those who want to do based on Islam. Oh, uh, Master sent another shame. email again. Uh, I mean, shame, another you know? message again. She said. Uh, because uh, so doing this like is just a double of shame to our again, I mean, to us again. Uh, it is a shame to our community, really. It is. Thank you very much for your beautiful comments. You can send your comment through. We're going to read your comment to the audience so that they can uh, listen to it. Uh, later on, we're going to open the call line so you can call and be part of the show. And uh, tell us your impact. I mean, make sure yeah. you uh, 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 in, take your. I mean, make sure you be. I mean, you uh, 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 take impact by sharing this video as well. But uh, for now, if you have any issue to discuss on the show, you can be a uh, like on the show where you're gonna go at the right hand corner. You're going to see a little video sound and then click on the video. You're going to be live. Everybody going to see you live speaking. And then you make your point, make your point to the situation. Tell us how can we handle the situation. Because it's not very free. Somebody sent a message all right, brother, si brother Sokono Duple is watching us at this time, and uh, Ibrahim Mande Masa Masarin is watching us too, and uh, Matene E Kaba is watching us. Make sure you contribute towards this video by sharing this video so that uh, we can post up to some rudeness in our district. Musa Sano is here too, and uh, Madisu, Madusu, Madusu is watching us, and Musa Kamara. Don't stop lying to my people. Uh, Minneapolis, Minnesota is watching us at this time. 
All right, a lot of people, man, Fatumata Keita, she's here watching us at this time too. Max Lama Dunk is watching us too. Muski Jabate, brother, if you are listening to me, we need an immediate apology from this guy by insulting seven to eight imams in our district. He said he asking God, now we. Imam Kone did not participate. Calling people Imam, names, Imam Zize, Imam Sano, Imam Well, oh my goodness, Imam Seku. Calling people names, complete rudeness. All right. This guy need to apologize or else he's gonna get his first guru guru blow from me. Because I can't leave him free. Oh, on the uh, yeah, I call it. We said uh, if lion see lion, lion lion lay. All right, you gonna apologize. We want to know from him. All right, we want to know from this guy who was the imam that told him. That we came on, I mean, we went to see God. God told us, say, Kone is the one who will be the winner of this representative election 2017. So he didn't give us that detailed information. So this guy need to, you know, to tell us. All right, Masa, is, Masa already touched the video button. And uh, uh, I'm going to open your call line later on so that uh, you can give us your view live people can see you live massa is uh, giving us a lot of idea to watch this issue from philadelphia i think so from philadelphia yeah i think so all right she said another message again all right we're going to read that message later because uh, we want to give the recap first from the video that he makes today and uh, but this was the video this was the emotional video that he made this was the abusive video that he made to our imams this was the insult video that he made to our imams and is there is because of this video we need an immediate apology from him to our imams all right master said no one else but our own madingo brothers disgracing Disgracing our elders, disgracing our elders people and in, I mean, on social media, that was not right in my opinion. Yes, it was not right at all. And we will not entertain that from anybody, even you are crazy. Because people send a lot of comments, say, oh, forget about Mark, Mark is not too well, Mark is not normal, sometimes is out of the track sometimes he's not normal so if you're not normal don't insult all right if you know you're not normal don't insult our area because you can make stupid statement some stupid people on the corner may say oh what this guy is saying is true because we know we know our neighbors don't like us all right jimmy smith winning the election is not a matter anybody can win all right Anybody can win, all right? Once you are Liberian, you participated in the election, you win. We're going to appreciate, we're going to congratulate you for your new position. That's not a matter. But do not come on social media, insult our imams because, because of self-interest, all right? All right, we are giving a recap on the video that he makes today. He said that uh, he's not against on uh he's not against our imam uh he's not trying to be rude on our imams but uh yes indeed we found out that uh, he's he he all he's already rude on our imam by insulting them uh by lying on their names by making false statement against them so i'm sorry for that 
But making state, uh, 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 I'm very sorry for that. But making false statement against them, so we want to make sure this guy apologized to our imam. And if, and if he did not apologize, what going to happen? All right. The next video we're going to discuss that. We're going to start from his the the entire profile because somebody just sent me the entire profile from beginning to the end about him. All right. So we're going to dismantle him like the way you dismantle, you know, like the way you dismantle your enemy, you know, that the way you would like to dismantle your enemy, time that you find yourself that you are anger. All right. All right. We're going to dismantle him. This guy, you need to apologize. All right. He said in today's video that um, he's not trying to be rude. All the imam, you know, know that he's a very respectful guy. He's not trying to be rude. But although he makes some emotional statement, I see that video to be a video of an apology. But the thing that's for the video, he said he did not regret of making that video. All right. I think this video, you should be at sin to say you did not regret of making that video. Sometimes we all we know we are all human beings. You make some statement and then you can realize later on that yes, indeed, the statement that I make, you know, it was emotional. The statement that I make, I didn't make of riches. The statement that I make, I didn't hear it from nobody. That was my opinion that I, that I, I pass over to people. That was his opinion. All right. Uma Sumawuro just joining us and Aliyu Manju Mamanya Kuma just joining us. All right. So our discussion here, Mark Jabate insulted, insulted seven to eight imams in district number two and an immediate apology is needed from him. All right. So this is why he stated in his video today so far that I really understand like uh, he make a little point. So on this point, uh, our today's video is that uh, to tell him that he need an immediate apology to our leader. He need an immediate apology to our imams. And if at if and if he cannot make this apology, he cannot make this apology video. I swear to God, we're gonna go to him. We're gonna go to him life. All right. We are not trying to threat him, but he's a man. We are men. I should be a junior brother to me, or a junior brother to him. He should be my senior brother. But if senior brother does not believe, I mean, does not behave like senior brother, we don't have to keep short. Hey, you know, you go ahead, you insult your dads, you insult, you know, uh, your leaders. There is only three things God stated, all right, by advising us that you should respect your mother. First, for in first place, respect your mother. Second place, respect your father. And the third place, you should respect your teachers, your leaders, teacher, leader, respect them. Anybody that is ahead of you, respect them. And if you fail to respect them, God will restrict you. And you know, God will send somebody to you, lion to you that you know that has more power than you. And, you know, to redeem you until you apologize to your statement that you make, emotional statement that you make. All right. So, uh, we want to make people understand that for saying Mark Jabate is not normal, it's not this, it's not that, I don't think this should be encouragement statement to his stupidity words that he's passing across, you know, to people. You know, or uh, we we have to make sure that if you make any statement we dig you know we dig on the statement to know where he got all his source you know and uh, as you can see we take a lot of call yesterday from a lot of people that participated in the meeting that yes indeed imam passes the information to the audience that uh, uh, that participated on the meeting of uh, 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 of selecting one person to be carried for the election. And the imams did not say any bad word. What they said, that's what happened exactly. They stated something conditionally. And the condition that was there regarding to the statement that they make, 
the condition was not respected and it led to our downfall. So why are you coming on social media and you know, to blame the people? All right, Ali, you, Manju, Mamanya, Kroma, you know, just saying uh, a comment by saying that uh, Matt's statement was not serious to us ready. All right, it was not serious. I know it was not serious, but uh, it, it was not serious to us. But our neighbors, our people, they know in Liberia, they, if they hear him speaking like that and they're going to say, oh, this is Madingo man, he cannot lie against his own tribe. He cannot lie against his own religion. So they're going to take it, you know, they, they're going to take that or uh, 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 state, I mean, that a uh, 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 a few words that he passed over into consideration. So we're trying to erase this in the minds of people. All right. So, like I was saying, uh, if something happens, like the way uh, Sekane, you know, lose the election, you know, anywhere you are, uh, anywhere you are, actually, you know, if you are a Madingo from district number two, if we actually to admit the fact uh, we are not happy at all. And, you know, we are not happy at all because to me, district number two is the only district so far in Monrovia that occupies the majority, the majority Madingo population. All right. That occupy the massive Madingo population. All right. This one a uh, 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 district should be, you know, under our room. That was our plan. But anyway, if we make plan and then it fail, uh, anyway, that's the way of God. We cannot change it. All right. Now, what the Imam said in their meeting, through the information that we gather, through the research that we gather. All right. The the Imams stated that in the meeting that okay. The this coming election we have about 15, 15 representatives that register for district number two. All right, and you know about fifteen representatives that re register for district number two. Can you imagine just one district, fifteen about fifteen representatives register to be a, a representative for district number two? So in this fifteen representative there was seven madingo seven muslim candidates seven madingo seven muslim aspiring to uh i mean uh, for district number two so this is how the imam said oh if we go like this it will be like we'll be uh on unified and it will be uh uh uh, uh we, we won't make it because people will be scattered people everybody will go on their own way because if my brother, like my brother, ain't no running for the position, I cannot go cash my vote for no one else. I'm going to go to my brother, sir. Uh, somebody else is going to go to his brother, sir. So why are you going to bring? You're going to bring this unity in our community. So the imam said that we should try to be, we should try to unify our community. Let us try to carry one representative. Let us try to carry, I mean, uh, uh, one aspiring. Uh, 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 one candidate so that we can win this election as we did for the past election. All right. This is what the Imam said. And then they said, regarding the only way we can win this election from the vision that we are saying, the only way we can win this election is that we should be, we should be, you know, we should be a uh, 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 we should be a uh, 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 good unity Madingo people in district number two. What do I mean? We should try to carry only one candidate so that everybody can cast their vote to this one person or for this one person so we can maintain this district. All right, so this district can, you know, still on our rule. But if we cannot do that, actually, somebody else is going to take the position from us. 
And that will happen exactly. My people, let's choose one person. Everybody vote the person. Everybody in our Madingo community vote the person so that this district can stay in our hand. If not, somebody else is going to claim it. And that's how it, 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 it was. So why should you come on social media to come and insult all the imams and, you know, uh, 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 for that, just because of political matter. Eh? This is not fine. Ben Umaru Keita Ture is watching us. Asata Dumuya Sano is watching us. And uh, my brother is already here. Aliyu Manju Mamaya Kuma. All right, all right. He just sent messages. He sent a comment. He said, uh, okay, one second. Jimmy Smith people was making Mogre. Oh my goodness, this is a sad uh, message again. Jimmy Smith people was making more on on us yesterday, saying that they have taken over. <laughs> oh brother, it's, uh, it's so sad. Say that they are taking over Guinea. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <sighs> anyway. All right, Ake Jabate just do just joining us uh, watching this show right now. That's my blood sister. Sister, if you are watching our discussion, it's on Mark Jabate that decided to insult seven to eight imams in district number two. If you have any important messages, you can send your comments so we can read your comment to the audience. They they're gonna read it. I mean, they're gonna understand what you're trying to say. What is your point of view? What is your idea to resolve this situation? Like uh, Mr. Ali just sent uh, his uh, uh, comment that Jimmy Smith people was making more out of them yesterday. And uh, they were saying that uh, they take over the Guineans. Oh, my goodness. They take over Guinea. All right. So, so like I was saying, that was the exact statement that the imams make. Our visions that we see this coming election 15, about 15 representatives registered for this one district and seven Muslim, seven Madingos, you know, uh, 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 register, I mean, uh, seven Madingos is standing for district number two. If you remain like that, it will be disunity. If you remain like that, it will be scattered, it will be, you know, everybody will have to go on his own way. So we're not going to win this election. Uh, Madingo's not going to win this election. So what we need to do, we need to make sure we choose only one candidate and then we carry this one candidate so that this district can remain in our hand. If, if not, they, this is the condition now. They say, if not, that's why they say, if not, this district is not going to remain with us. And that's what happened exactly. All right? So, why should you come on social media insult people? Why should you come on social media insulting our imams? Or uh, you make Sisikara, uh, you, you told us that you see God, God told you, uh, 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 um, Brother Seku Kane going to win, uh, Brother Seku Kane did not win. In fact, you guys, you are liars. You guys are liars. You are, def uh, you, 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 uh, I call it, you, you lie to us, you mislead us with your mislead information, and uh, you need to apologize. In fact, God will punish you. You lie on God's name. Our Moses is not political ground. That's the one statement that he basing on. He said, our Moses is not political ground. If you are a weaver pusher, or if you are a cabo, the only thing you know is the role. If you see a car, you're going to run and, and hang on a car. Or if you are a weeba pusher, the only place you know is the market. So if you are, a, uh, the, uh, uh, if you are, if you are an imam, the only place you know and the only place you have to pass your message over to people is the mosque. You cannot walk from your house or you walk from house to house passing your information up. These people are our leader. These people are the people that we can take, we can, uh, uh, take our decision on, I mean from. 
these people are the people that we can listen to in order to be, you know, on a straight path. You can't come on social media and express your emotional feeling on them just like that. And then you say you want to walk out free. No, you should stay with God of you for it before you walk out. All right. Brother Yakuba Sako is watching us right now. So, Brother Yakuba, if you are watching us now, our today discussion is on Mark Jabate insulting seven to eight imams in district number two. And uh, we need an immediate apology from him. He makes a video today. I seen that video to be a video of an apology because that video was not emotional. But uh, the only thing that's for that video, he said he was not, you know, he's, he did not regret of making this insult, this abuse, this, this counter video that he made. So this is why we are making this video uh, and uh, making sure that he apologize to uh, the imams. All right, he need to apologize, not only apologizing to the imams, he need to exist himself from doing those acts. Because a lot of people sending me a lot of comments about him. They say, oh, this is how he is. Hey, you know, that's why people don't like him. He can say anything at any time. He can say anything that he feel like. You know, if somebody fathers die, and maybe... The person father was a big thief. And then when you come to sympathize to the person, then you say, oh, yeah, your father died. I'm sorry, but your father was a big thief. You know yourself right there what's going to happen. We, the Madingo of District Number 2, we are already feeling pain of losing the election. Then you come in all again with emotional statement that will discourage everybody. That will even encourage, that will even encourage our neighbor, and you know, to go against us, and you know that oh, we understand why you guys are making it a must. People told us that why you guys are doing it a must, but this time it can't work. People sending me that message. They send me that message. That oh, we understand that why you guys are doing it a must, but now we we you know we discover that story, it can't work anymore. So you need to exist yourself from doing this. People say, oh, Mark is not too correct. Mark, Mark is sometimes, you know, uh, has, uh, you know, mental problem, this, that. If you have a mental problem, then take yourself out of journalism. All right? If you don't have nothing to say, keep your dirty mouth shut. All right? Don't insult our imam. If you don't have anything to say, your ignorance mouth, keep it short because you don't know nothing. You haven't gotten no information, nothing. You was not even there. I mean, you, 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 you were not even there by the time the, the meeting was headed in a mosque. The statement that the imam said, you were not even there. You wasn't there. Why should you come on social media and be telling all bullshit, stupidity? Eh? If you don't apologize tomorrow when I come here to do video on you, I swear to God, your lively profile will pass over to the people. All right? And then I turn around again and go to you. I'm telling people now, and people that know me from day one up to now, they, they know me, they believe me. If I make any statement, I can make sure that that statement that I make, I make sure, you know, I realize it. I'm going to practicalize that statement that I make. All right? You need to apologize. Of insulting our leaders all right once again I'm gonna play the video that uh, the abuse video that Mark Jabaten make so that you can listen to, to, to the video if you just joining us and uh, from there we're gonna take call from people and you know that that uh, you know listen to his uh, video his today's video and you know so that they can tell us too how can we handle this situation if everybody say that uh, we should forget about this situation and no, uh, and I don't have problem. We're gonna forget about it, but uh, I'm not seeing it necessary for an individual, common individual like Mark Jabate, coming on social media insulting the imam. And yesterday, I decided to call him to call him so that I can address him, you know, uh, 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 to my satisfaction. But uh, he, he answered the call three times and then he dropped the line because he knew that what I'm about to tell him. All right, he knew. 
Uh, this guy connected us, you know, online, brother Sheik Kafumba Dukle. I, I, you know, thanks and appreciation unto you for connecting Mark Jabate yesterday to the show. And I believe that he heard all the, 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 the messages that passed over yesterday. And I believe today's message too, he's going to hear it. If he don't apologize, I swear to God, you will be good. You will be good. We can be anyone when tell us any stupid, any mislead information. We can take it. We not we we are not here for no stupidity to to uh, you know to be listening at. All right. If you tell us anything, it should be right. It should be uh, 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 it should be based on the truth. Don't come on with any uh, 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 self statement or any opinion, and then you say this is what our imams are doing the most, and then people listening to that. Eh? So. I'm giving you a few minutes to listen to what he said because I'm seeing a lot of people just joining us, even Nesta, CEO, Kamara just joining us too. So listen to the video as well. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, man. You know, and Are you seeing him, right? Message. Are you seeing him, right? Most of our imams can be educated. All right, let me add the volume on, right? Most of our imams. Recently, before the election, yeah, about Imam when he closed door, he told her in this show number two that when the Shuku Kanan going to win the election, they said they have a revelation from God. About seven or eight Imams, they all went in focus. They said they have a revelation that from Shukunen here we're going to be election. taking call from but people uh, in this show number two area. There, it's anybody focused. can call and, and give your view. Canada. Regarding this issue, please, when you call, do not talk on different issues. We want to address this issue to conclude this issue. All right? As a political institution, using the mosque as a political institution does not make sense. What I tell you is again, but when it comes to God, God is God believe in what fairness. God believe in what justice. God believe in justice. If you are here and then you want to be on live with me tonight, we can go ahead on the right, on the bottom, I mean, at the bottom side, I mean, on the right bottom side of your cell phone or your monitor, and then you're going to see a little video sign, and then click on that video sign, you're going to be live with me, so that the audience can get your view. If you don't know how to go on the bottom Why side you of your a monitor and then you're going to call you're on messenger, you're going to call me directly on messenger and then Although you're going to be live. People, everybody is going to listen to uh, your opinion. Somebody is asking me, how can we call you? Aliyu, Manju, Mamaya, Koma. Right, that's why I just said, Aliyu, if you want to make a call, go at the bottom right side of your cell phone or monitor you're going to see a little video sound with human head in between you know in the middle then click on that so you can be added to i mean uh, 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 on live so you can be added me you can you're going to come directly on live automatically so you can express your i mean you can give us your view you can give us your view you can tell us how can we handle i mean handle this situation or uh, if not, if you don't know how to get connected uh, live, then you can call me directly on Messenger, and then you're going to be added. Everybody will listen to you, and you yourself, you're going to be listening to yourself while speaking. That is all God. God told him that's who's going to win the election. Nesta also sent an uh, email, I mean, uh, uh, a comment that uh, that uh, that man is mad. <laughs> Just leave so him they, alone. The Almighty will judge him. They are all yes. Awesome. The no, Almighty are going to judge awesome. him, but uh, if we and keep leaving him the just like that, you know, there will be no... The, the, our, our, you know, he's going to be continue, continue the doing the this. Way. And like people are going to be listening to him in our community, destroying people, insulting people, and then walk out free. Do you know how long this guy been insulting people? Do you know how long this guy been making emotional video? Long, long period of time making emotional video, nobody is talking. But we are the voice of the voiceless. So we need to talk. We need to talk to discouraging of making rudeness on our, you know, leaders. Our imam has been disgraced by the Almighty Allah. Look at that. Our imam needs to be thanked. 
Emotional statement, abuse statement, complete rudeness. Your father's equal. One who respects other father can also respect his father. And one who cannot respect his own father will never respect the other's father. Who was the imam that told you mouth to mouth or words to word that yes indeed I went I saw God or I make Sisikara I saw Sekene he was a he was a uh, 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 winner who calling people name calling their muscles calling their location calling their name why who are you and telling us that you telling the truth to the imam who are you to tell truth the to, the, to, the, to the imam. Eh? Who are you? Just a common native stupid dog. Ayuba Sharif is watching us live. Ayuba just joining us, listening to this guy insulting our leaders, seven to eight imams in district number two. This time we can take no stupid help from no one. We live in a modern world. If you make any statement, we know the way to dig after and then know the real truth. The source of the statement that you're giving us, we need to know. And like from, from yesterday's video, I believe that you guys listen to the audience, those that participated, the meeting that the imams had, you know, in the mosque. All right, you listen to them and uh, they told us what exactly happened. Some imams even call and tell us exactly what happened. They spent about about half an hour speaking to us, telling us exactly what happened. And, you know, and what, what, what led to our defeat, they told us everything. And we are, we are happy because uh, this time our defeat, uh, we are think um, we, we pray for our defeat because uh, we was unable to be you know, united. All right, for those that are listening to us now, if you want to make a call after this video, you can call. And if you don't know how to make a call, just send a comment, okay. Once I see okay, you know, I'm going to call you directly. I mean, just say a comment or say nice or okay, you know, or you press on like, uh, on like, you know, symbol on the uh, uh, right hand side corner, and then I'm going to call you. Or you go on the right hand side corner, the little video sound with him or her in between, then click on that, you're going to be out there, and then you can call on live so people can see you while speaking, people can see you while talking, expressing your point, telling us. The, the way we can handle this situation. So what happened now? Eh? Did we spend how long? Did we spend how long? That's what we do. So what are you going to do now, Imam? Imam, you need to apologize. Once again, my name is Mohammed Manju Toure. You need to apologize for the coming to your to for the coming voice of the voiceless. Because you keep up, like you said. If you talk, they say no, the imam, imam can accept so any war, you know, or so our imam is, uh, anybody so can say anything, if you are a leader, you don't have to make any argument, this, that. yeah, you can say anything that you want to say, but don't insult, don't abuse them, alright, and if the imams keep to be patient on the insult that this God did, uh, actually, we cannot take it, alright. Ali, you say, okay, that means he wants to be added on the call. So I'm going to pause the video and call Ali you, um, at this time so we can get uh, Ali you, Manju, you know, a view regarding this uh, situation. All right. Do you have anything in Sinikala call? Do you have anything in. All right. Now we're gonna be taking call from people. Yeah. So those that want to call once again, if you don't know how to call, you can send okay. And uh, we're gonna make sure everybody, you know, give us uh, their view regarding the situation. Please, when you call, don't talk on different issue. Just address this issue, please. Uh, when you 
record, don't discuss on anything else. Just tell how you feel. All right. So, so now we're going to be calling people here. Aliu, Aliu Manju, Omar Castro. It was a few minutes. We apologize the inconvenience. We wanted to make sure everybody expressed their point of view regarding this issue. All right. I'll leave you. Uh, we're going to put you on live now. All right, we're gonna make sure to put you on live. And uh, now, Aliu, if you are listening to me this time, this is your call. Make sure you tell us. Uh, make sure you tell us how you feel. All right. Sako Soko uh, Abu Bilad want to come on and uh, address this issue. Oh, it seems that uh, Ali lines a little bit back. Oh. Oh, Ali, I'm sorry. We cannot wish you. All right, let me try one more time again. All right. Let me. All right, Aliyu is coming on, but it's better that we make this. Uh, we're gonna make this. All right, after Aliyu speak, then I'm gonna open the, the the call now on the messenger so that you can be live. While you speaking, people seeing you. All right. We're going to listen to Aliyu. Aliyu, if you are listening to me, you need to answer your call. Oh. All right. Let me, let me open. Uh, let me open. All right. The messenger line is open. You can call live. People can see you. All right. Aliyu say no way for me. All right. Aliyu, if you are listening to me, go at the bottom right hand side. And then the little video photo that is there, you can click on that little video photo and then you're going to be live with me. I want you to be live so people can see you exactly and uh, so you can tell us how to handle this situation. Mr. Sako Soko Abdullah Bilad, if you are listening to me, click on the little video that has little human hair in between and then you're going to be live with me. On the right hand corner, at the bottom side. So go ahead. All right. Sana Sheriff just joining us. Okay. So this is the best time you can call. Ali said no way, and I was trying to wait for him to be added, but uh, however, uh, Ali, you we stay waiting for your call. I'm going to call you again. Knowing yourself is the best. Knowing yourself. All right, somebody sent an email about this. And uh, he's no one else but uh, Yusuf Sharif. 
He said that, uh, all right, Ali is on. Good evening, Ali. Yeah, how are you? Yeah, brother, how are you? I'm fine. What is your name and where you calling from? Yeah, I'm Ali Manju, my man. I'm calling from Chekotan District 2, Gladina. Oh, I appreciate your call from District number 2. Yeah. So uh, you know, I believe that you keep uh, listening to us and you know how to this, this discussion here. And uh, we want us, you tell us how to handle this situation. Yeah, what I see in this question is it Mark Javadier? Some of the people have not been named Mark Javadier personally, really. I'm not Mark Javadier from Zero Poly, Sydney. But some of our big brothers are in the district, and some of them have not been taking serious action against Mark Javadier. And some of you guys that are abroad, you're not have to. This is this situation was not so be handled by you people. We are we we in the situation that was the one that that's the one takes you as against Madawate. And for you to know that when you trying to share in the in our district, this this one trying to disgrace us. Yeah. In it. And it, even if Christians have not so to see these kind of things, you see it. All right. And do matter. No problem. Exactly. Thank you very much. And uh, the next caller here will be Sako Soko. Uh, the brother is trying to call us and uh, give us his intention, you know, uh, and uh, tell us what exactly we need to do about this situation. Mark Jabate, common men like Mark Jabate insulting seven to eight imams in district number two. And then he expecting us to leave him just like that. And then he walk away. And uh, he even said in a video that he will continue doing a video until the imams can be educated. Mashallah. So why are we sitting down? Eh? What are we doing? If let let imagine if this was your father, if the if one of the imams are your father, right? Will you entertain that? Come on, may just come and insult your father just like that because of political reason. You're not even a good journalist. I don't even think you have any doc documentation to show that, yes, indeed, you are a journalist. Right? I don't think so. So uh, we're going to connect our brother here and uh, in order to get his point of view. 
uh, regarding this issue of Mark Madman Jabate. All right, somebody just sent a comment that uh, uh, let us be bro, I mean, let us be bo. He's, I'm sorry, he said, let us be bo, we the Madingo, we are not like the, the, the we don't like one another, honestly. How will we like one another if we're not united? That's the question. And uh, Ayuba Sheris uh, sent a comment. He said, "Knowing yourself is the beginning, is the beginning of your of your wis of all wisdom." So, for me, I'm not surprised that uh, how he always behaves. All right, he said he's not surprised because you know that's that is his attitude. He always do this. I mean, he's doing this all the time. So we want to post up to it. All right, brother Bilad, I mean, Abu Bilad Soko Sako, uh, we're trying to call you now so you can be out there and uh, give us your view to tell us how can we handle the situation. All right, thank you. Brother is online and uh, he's on live. Oh, I think the connection should be a little bit bad. However, his connections should be bad a little bit. Oh. All right, I'm going to call him back again because he really has something important to say. So if once again, if you want to call, this is the best time you can call by clicking the... Your own life. Yeah, I'm doing myself. Cool. What is your name and where are you calling from? Oh, my name is Musa Kenneth. I'm calling from New York. New York. Welcome to the show. Yeah, bro. Thank you. What do you have to say regarding Mark Jabate to this video? Do you watch Mark Jabate to this video? Come again? He made another video today regarding uh, the issues that we discussed yesterday. I think it was on yesterday. So did yeah, you I did I you look at did you watch today's video? Yeah, I watched the video. No, I no, the know. video that Mike Jabate made today. Did you look at it? Today? Yeah. Uh, today? Yeah. I mean, I did not see that. All right. So what is your comment to the show? Yeah, what I'm trying to say right now, because yesterday I listened to you guys who were saying something. What my brother, uh, Mark Jabeta said about a leader. You understand? Mm -hmm. what, my, what Mark Jabeta is saying, to be honest, you know, Mark Jabeta went to a plus. But the media is what? Why are you, say, why are you saying that Mark Jabeta went over plus? Okay, the reason I'm saying what Mark Jabeta was saying, it's true because first it, of all, let's see. Mean, Why are you saying Mark Jabate went over plus? Okay. What okay, means by that? Saying, okay. The reason he went over plus because he said something. Something like how? So, you know, you're talking to I'm, thousands of people, so they want to know what exactly. I'm, 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 because the reason I'm saying this. Yeah, Jabi, you I'm need to be clear so that people can get your view. All right. You understand? I'm coming to my view. Ma the way he attacked the imam, he was wrong. You understand? Okay. But the reality is what? Yeah. Because he appointed the imam, the executive imam, the guiding imam, the chief imam. You understand? Mm -hmm. He also to call the name of the imam. That is right. But what my daughter was saying, we the Magdibo, we are not together. All right. You understand? We are not together. The religion issue, it's not a political issue. Our leader, the answer will go through in political. 
You understand? Okay. So now, we are losing our uh, food. So what we, we, have, we have to think, how can we get the addition of our food back again? You understand? So mm -hmm. what my was saying, yeah, that is your question. So that is your question. How can we, how can we get this train number two back again? Again. Mm -hmm. All right. People are sending comment right now. People, somebody said that uh, I will appreciate you put this, uh, uh, this in your dialect, and uh, he also said that uh, tell him please. All right. All right, he said, he said that uh, somebody is telling us that uh, he will appreciate so you can say it in Madingo so they can understand it better. Okay, they want to do okay. Uh, Madungo, you have to tell me how to come up with it. So I have to tell you, I'm going to tell you about the and I'm going to tell you about the and I'm going to tell you about the video and start your personal life. What is my thing? So I have to There was division, right? Division came about. Yes. Okay. This issue should be discussed via intellectual forum. All right, bro. So I'm going to stay connect you as well. Mike is wrong. Somebody said Mike is wrong. Okay, go ahead. I'm sorry for interrupting. Keep your messages coming. So we're going to read your messages and uh, so that the audience can know your 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 view. Uh, regarding this issue, Mark Jabate insulting seven to eight imams in our district. Uh, um, this uh, issue is uh, reported to you by Mohamed Manjuture of district number two, currently residing in United States of America to be per sec, Newark, New Jersey. All right, people listening to you. Go ahead. We have a lot of discussion to discuss, but today's discussion is that uh, why Mark Jabate has to be brave to insult yeah. seven to eight yep. imams yep. in Jokovstan. Yep. So you yep. have to go straightly yep. to the point so yep. that the audience can understand why exactly, what is your, uh, uh, your view, you know, how do you see the situation and how can we handle the situation? So that's the question. <laughs> Mm 
All right. So, um, what do you have to tell Madingo people, you know, for next time, you know, uh, in electing one of our, uh, our, our Madingo brother in district number two? All right, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Brother Seku. Uh, I mean, Brother Musa, people still want to talk, people want to uh, send their comment, and uh, people trying to be part of the show. So, um, we're going to give another person, I mean, uh, we're going to give another person a chance to express his view too as well. Thank you so much for being part of the show tonight. All right. Okay, if you're just joining us out to this discussion, Mark Jabate insulting seven to eight imams in district number two. So an immediate apology is needed from him. So what do you say about that? All right. Now I'm seeing my brother is... Uh, all right. He want to be on life. And uh, the land cannot permit him. His connection is a little bit down. Uh, and uh, he really need to be life. If you want to be life, you can be life on uh, your cell phone. Just click on the little button that says, I mean, that has video symbol. Click on that, and then you're going to come on life with the show. All right? People are going to see you. People are going to listen to you as well. All right, but for this time, I think your line is a little bit hard. And uh, another option again, if you have anything to say, you can say okay. And then if you send uh, okay, okay comment on uh, uh, the show, and then I'm going to exactly know that you have something to say, and then I'm going to connect you so you can pass your message over to Madingo people that are listening to you at this time. Thank you. Ah, oh, brother, still want to talk. Don't go, don't go on video. Just come directly. Don't go on video, please. Don't connect the video because your line is not okay. Good evening. Hey, how you doing, sir? I'm, I'm, I'm fine, uh, Mr. Sako. So our today's discussion, I hope that uh, you are listening to us live and uh, you are seeing us, but because of the connection, you cannot be live, right? Yeah, that's true. All right. So what do you have to tell us about this, I mean, to handle this situation? And what, what, what is your advice to Madingo people for next election? Well, because of the connection, you cannot be live. Yeah, uh, look, uh, thank you so much for having me today. Hello? Yeah, we are listening, and the people listening yeah. to you as well. Yeah, thank you so, thank you so much for having me, and um, it is a real pleasure for me to be online. Yeah, you need to tell and, us your name and where you're calling from, so that the audience can know. Yes, yeah, Susu person call from Susu, please. Yeah, my name is Mohamed Sakur, and uh, commonly known as uh, Ubilad, and I'm calling from the state of Alaska. Uh, Alaska. Yeah, the people listening to you as well. Oh, welcome to the show. Welcome, uh, welcome to the show. Oh, why well, I'm repeating myself in this video? Welcome to the show, brother. Yeah. Oh, welcome to the show. Yeah, so here is it. What what Mark is saying is wrong. All right. Why Mark is wrong? Yeah, first of all, um he from Welcome to the show, brother. Yeah. 
I said Mark is wrong for many, many reasons. And the first reason that I can state here is this. Um, he, he doesn't have the audacity to, to, to align to those uh, leaders, Muslim leaders. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. We listen to you. It is uh, the, the the connection that is uh, you know repeating stuff, but uh, everybody listening to you. Yeah. He doesn't have the audacity to. Oh my God. This is. Okay. And also, yeah, and also, and also, he doesn't have that religious uh, 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 education. Yes, uh, Islamic education to say that well, the istikhara that those scholars did was wrong. They would be lied. Allah revealed to them. So all these are nonsense. Okay. He, Mike, I knew him for a long time. He's someone who tried to uh, proclaim. Yeah, the line was so bad. I appreciate you up the line. So we're going to reconnect it by because. Uh, I, there was too much of repeating words, I mean, self-repeating words in there. Yeah.